of Hunter and Brian's Airsoft videos. We're doing tactical things that I've bought personally tried. Y'all may think some of these are that you'll find better stuff. But this is just things I've tried and I thought they were pretty good. Alright, Brian's. Alright, this is the little beginner kit you can start out with. A little blue flashlight. So it's pretty bright actually. And then it has rails and stuff like that. It's pretty good. And then you got a laser right here. It's not real trustworthy, but if you play around with it, it'll go bad. But, I mean, pretty good laser. You clip it onto your rail, then you have it right on your grip. And when you squeeze your grip, it'll turn on. And then you got your red dot sight right here. You just put on your gun, and then flip the switch. There you go. It's on. And then... This whole kit right here at Bass Pro Shop was 15 bucks. You that's, get all three of them total 15 bucks. The Swiss Arms and Gear, uh, $15. Dollars. Um, and this light, like if neon colors really shine out, when you, it's like a black light. All right, then you got this scope mount right here. It, it's, a, it's for um, a scope a sniper, you know. That's this scope does not come with it. This is the rail. It has other rails on it. You can connect other stuff to it if you want to. This is scope we found around the house. It has rails. Put in a sniper. There you go. Bang. There's scope. Alright. Um, these are my side sniper. Same company that made that rail. They're metal AR sights. So, so if you have the scope on your gun but you want to use your iron sights for closer range, you just they sit underneath here pretty much like that so you can use them on the side. These are really good. They're metal. If you're a sniper, it'd be great to have them. This is a laser I found. It's a pistol laser, but it's really good. But it kind of batteries ran out, so I really can't show you very much. But that's about it. And it has a rail on top of it, so if you want to put something else on top of it, it's really small. I have this flashlight I got from Home Depot. I think it's about $15. It's a Lux Pro P290. It's a really bright flashlight, as you can see. It's got a low dim one, and then it's got a strobe. Um... That flashlight is really bright. It's like a mini spotlight. Alright, then we have this grip, which if you saw my other video, it comes with AK. You can see it on Amazon too. I don't know what brand name it is, but just look up folding grip. Um, then you have the this. It's an airsoft sight protector. Um, if you turn, so say if you have this, like a, a, a uh, red dot sight. It says you can use it like this, but I do not say you should. Because it'll crack if an aerosol baby hits it. So if you put it like this, it'll just ricochet off the top of it. Yeah, you probably get hit in the head, but I mean, you'll be alright. Ain't gonna hurt for a minute. And then you got and this. It, it does come with a yellow, yellow one. one. It makes the world brighter, wherever it is. Nighttime. You the same thing for nighttime. Lights it up a little bit. It doesn't go on top of the clear one. You gotta take the clear one off, then put it on the screws. Comes with a little iron wrench to do that. And um, then it just melts on your picture. Right? Then this is a Penti holographic scope sight. It has red and green, and there's brightness level, so, so for indoors you have it low brightness, and for outdoors you have it high brightness. Really good. I love it. It's like a real AR site. It usually goes for about $100, but it's $20 on Amazon, which is a really good price. Um, it has four selectors. It has four different selector sites. I'm going to see if maybe y'all might see one. 